Yo, what's up everybody? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I know it's been so while. It's almost a year since my last video. Ya. Yeah. Sudah hampir setahun semenjak video terakhir di channel ini. But today we are gonna learn how to make yeah, maybe you have seen Nano Langer transition on his channel about Philippines, you know that ink transition effect, but we're gonna learn how to apply this effect to Vegas Pro. Yep, it's not that hard, so let's jump to this tutorial. Okay, before we jump into the tutorial, I'm gonna let you guys know that I've been using Vegas Pro 15 lately. It's great, it's beautiful, the UI is completely dark, which is looks more professional, and it's awesome. Yeah, Vegas Pro 15 ini keren banget, UI-nya yang gelap membuat tampilan lebih profesional, but don't worry about it. You can do this tutorial with the older Vegas Pro version. Yeah, kalian bisa mengaplikasikan tutorial ini di Vegas Pro versi sebelumnya. Bahkan kalian bisa menggunakan Vegas Pro versi 11 untuk melakukan tutorial ini. And for this tutorial, you guys gonna need this ink transition overlay effect, which is you can download it from the description box below ya jadi kalian bisa download uh, efek overlay tinta ini dari deskripsi box di bawah and it's completely free also this tutorial doesn't require any plugins so don't worry about it ya tutorial kali ini kita juga nggak akan menggunakan plugin tambahan jadi kita hanya menggunakan plugin internal dari Vegas Pro bawaan so without further ado let's do this first you're gonna need three video track ya karena akan membutuhkan tiga video track agar transisi ini bisa diaplikasikan dengan baik ya kita tambahkan insert video track insert it again so we're gonna have three video track yep so the second video track will be used for the transition effects only ya untuk track kedua ini kita akan hanya mengaplikasikan khusus untuk ink transitionnya jadi we're gonna change the compositing mode to compositing child okay then on the first video track we're gonna change it change the compositing mode to multiply yeah jadi kita akan mengubah compositing mode pada track kedua menjadi compositing child pada track pertama kita akan menggunakan compositing mode nya menjadi multiply if you are using the older version of Vegas Pro you will find the compositing child mode in here with the arrow icon kalian jika kalian menggunakan Vegas Pro 11, 12, 13, 14 kalian akan menemukan back compositing channel itu berada di bawah sini untuk panah ke atas kalian klik itu maka secara otomatis akan menjadi compositing channel dan kalian akan mengubah video track pertama menjadi mask kalian akan menemukan compositing icon compositing mode nya itu mungkin berupa kotak gitu ya saya agak lupa karena sudah menggunakan Vegas Pro 15 cukup lama change the compositing mode to multiply okay just like that then drag your second clip to the first video track ya yeah, harus mendrag clip kedua kalian yang akan ditransisikan ke track pertama kemudian 
kemudian tambahkan transisi tinta ini ke second clip second video track yep. make it strike like this jadi kita akan menggunakan sejajar tata kiri dan tata kanan dan you're gonna add video effects chroma key add the chroma key to the ink transition overlay change it to black solid color and add white below your second clip and beside your transition overlay just like that jadi cuma seperti itu cara memperbaiki error black screen dari preset ini jadi kalian yang perlu menambahkan solid color warna putih ke bawah second clip kalian dan tepat di samping in transition overlay kalian so what if we gonna add another ink transition effect after your second clip it's not that hard let's jump to it so jadi gimana cara kalian akan menambahkan efek ink transition lagi setelah transisi pertama first go to your project media add your second ink effect this is for your second clip go to video effects from a key then change the blue black again done this is a little bit tricky for the second clip yep which is you need to right click your second ink effect choose reverse and you're done let's see how it goes Boom. just like that easy peasy right customize your blurry effect from the ink ya jadi kalian bisa mengatur seberapa kalian ingin blurnya ini segimana caranya adalah when you are in your ink clip choose event effects you can adjust the loft result height result etc but for me I'm gonna leave it default like this and then how are we gonna add the third ink transition effect just like you add the first one yep sama seperti kalian menambahkan efek pertama drag it here add video effects chroma key changes to black don't need to add the reverse effect because you're gonna add it in the next if you're gonna add another ink transition effect All right now before I get to add the white solid color here I'm gonna not, I'm not gonna do this you guys already know it so let's see how it goes just like that easy right okay so smooth so seamless ok 
okay that and that's all if you like this video you know what to do i'm not gonna say it and thank you see you in the next video